Mark 2.26. Pos es elthen es tan oikan tu theu epi abiathar archiereos kai tus artus tes protheseos ephagen hus uc existen fagen e me tus hireis kai eduken kai tois sun auto usen. Of course, this is a question. Notice it ends in a question mark there. And let's do some translation. How, of course, this is continuing Jesus' words to his opponents here, referring to David. Uh, how Ace Elthen, how he entered, that of course is from Ace Erkomai. Ace Erkomai, you see the Ace Elthen, that's a second aorist, active indicative, third singular. And notice how the uh, prepositional prefix is repeated in Koine Greek pattern. How he entered into the house of God. Of course, at this point, the tabernacle. Then we have this interesting phrase, epi abiathar archiereos. Very literally, upon abiathar, uh, the high priest. And so, does it mean, uh, what does that mean? Uh, most translations say at the time of abiathar, the high priest. Of course, one of the challenges here, if you look in First Samuel Chapter 21, the, the high priest at the time was Abiathar's father, Ahimelech. The, uh, and so we're going to do a Saturday or weekend feature uh, exploring this um, and trying to understand what this, what this epi means. There's several possibilities of it, and, and we can't really explore them fully unless we know Greek. So we'll talk about that, but we can just say, upon Abiathar the high priest, whether at the time or that, that passage in the Old Testament or so on, and... The bread of the presence, or the bread of the presentation, F again, he ate, um, which is not lawful to eat except for the priest, and he gave also to those being with him.